Welcome to True Insight, a premium channel partner for Altair Engineering. Introduction to 2D Meshing using Hyperworks 2022. 2D Meshing is the best tool to apply on components which are relatively two-dimensional such as sheet metal or a hollow plastic cowl. 2D Meshing, like the name suggests, creates two-dimensional elements on the chosen surface. There are two types of element shapes in 2D Meshing. The trea, which creates the elements in shape of a triangle, and the quad, which creates elements in the shape of a square or a rectangle. There are two types of elements within trea and quad respectively. One is the linear or first order elements having three nodes in the corners, and the second is a parabolic or second order elements having six nodes. On the quad side of the mesh, you have linear or first order quad containing four elements in the corners and parabolic or second order quad containing eight elements. Hyperworks 2022 makes most of the 2D meshing options accessible via the ribbons. Additional options can be found by clicking on the down arrow next to the menu name. Let's pick a sample model and create a 2D mesh. In this example, as you can see, the thickness is way smaller than its length or the width. In applications like these, engineers create a mid-surface and then perform the 2D mesh. But with Hyperworks 2022, users can create a 2D mesh directly. Go to the Mesh tab and find Mid Mesh under the 2D Mesh menu. You can see that there are various options to create, repair, edit, align and inspect a mid mesh. Let's select the automatic button and all you need to do is select the component. Enter the extraction size and click on the play button. This will automatically create a mid surface along the mid plane of the component. You can see the new mesh under the components browser as well. That's it for this video and in the next one we will look into advanced 2D meshing with an example. Please subscribe to our channel for more videos and tutorials and visit trueinsight.io for technical blogs and license information.